You kids think you can fool me. You think that I'm a fool. I know what goes on in your minds. I know you hate this school. I know you found you guys out ready? the yeah, go little ahead. tricks go to sneak a moment here and there. You think I don't know what you're ah. doing. Whatever you do, don't move. Coward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, movies? How many? Uh, six, Hey guys, I got some bad news about tonight. Uh, I'm not going to be able to make it. I'm grounded. Grounded? For what? Oh, Dios mío, no miren eso. Dios lo va a castigar. Last night. Man, why didn't you tell us this before, man? I didn't feel like it. Dude, that sucks. Yeah, I gotta go to confession tomorrow. Great. Ben, it's Friday. Can't you just talk them into letting you go out anyways? They don't care what day it is. And besides, me asking them will probably get things worse, so I'd rather not. Thank <laughs> you. 
find. Thank you. Hey guys, we have a visitor. State your name and business. I have something for you. Oh yeah? So, are you guys still having your sleepover tonight? Uh, yeah, I guess that. Yeah, how'd you know about that? <coughs> oh, I don't know. Word gets around, I guess. We're having one too, for Elizabeth's birthday. Of course, you probably already knew that. So maybe we'll see you there? Who would want to go to her stupid party anyway? Shut up! I'm not talking to you. Nobody cares if you show up. <laughs> <laughs> so what's the note say? Uh, it's nothing. Come on, what's it say? <laughs> nothing. Do on, does, it, does it say, do you like me? Circle yes or no. Would you go out with me? Yes or no. <laughs> what's it say? Come on, what's it say? <laughs> say by the whistle. Stop by my place too. There's something I gotta show you guys. I thought you were grounded. I am, but my parents won't be home until around 5:30. <laughs> hey, is your sister gonna be there? I don't know. Why? She's got a big crush on her. That's why. Oh, I don't. But you gotta admit, she's pretty hot. Yeah, I'd have to agree with that. <laughs> okay, let's change the subject. Okay. What if she wasn't your sister? Would you think she no. Would in? No. No. Hey, do you think all girls from Argentina are that hot? I don't know. I've never been there before, and besides, my mom's the only one from Argentina. Well, your mom definitely isn't hot. <laughs> Man, these things are awesome. Where'd you get them? At the mall. Really? What store? Hong Kong. <laughs> wow, that's cool. What other kind of stuff do I have over there? Ah, they got butterfly <laughs> knives, nunchucks, all sorts of stuff. Whoa, that's cool. Do they have switchblades? No switchblades. That they didn't have. Oh, uh, that sucks. Uh. Man. We should definitely head over there sometime. With a lot of money, of course. Yeah. We need to get a moving target so we can really master them. Yeah. Hey, I got an idea. Well, we have to go back to my house first. Uh, okay. That's good.
Are you sure you want to do this? Yeah, yeah, sure. Just don't hit my leg. Oh, hey. What time is it? How much time is it? I better get going. You sure? Yeah. <laughs> I gotta get home before my parents do. Alright then, we'll be sure to stay away because we didn't be bothered and you're not gonna pick you up. Yeah, we're ready. Right. I'm serious, man. Can you just, just don't go to sleep too early? Stay up late. Okay. 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 See ya. See ya. Okay, see ya. Have fun, you guys. Okay. Remember to stay awake, okay? Well, I don't know about you guys, but I'm just pretty hungry. Yeah, yeah, I could look for some food. Uh, also, we could order a pizza if we wanted. Pizza? Pizza's better than food. Yeah, pizza's good. <laughs> Supposedly, you can use it to talk to the spirit of the dead and ask it questions about the future. Those things are so creepy. Yeah, I figured it might be fun for us to do later on tonight. Okay, well, thank you. I am a lot of shots. I'm gonna go upstairs and get some more film. Okay. Girls you like at school? No. Any girls like you at school? No. 
So you know Miss Chong? Yeah. She is so nasty. Mark. Mark. What? She... Miss Chong is hot and you know it. She came to school and I looked at her legs and her legs are fine. I mean, I mean, she may be Mrs. Chong, but her legs are her legs are chong. Yeah, she has mm. shaped legs. Yeah, her legs are pretty. They're pretty. Sunny. Yes, Mom. Gotta come back in the day. Dude, you've already mentioned that. Got any gum? Turn right on starboard. with the He-Man figures alone. Well, being an only child does have its advantages. My brother got all my toys. Or at least the ones I didn't melt or blow up. Um, you guys want to watch a movie? Nah, yeah, this is all PG crap. I can't believe your mom actually thinks we like watching it. We should go over to my house. See the real good stuff. I got board games. Wow, board games. Yeah, dude. Let's go somewhere. Do something fun. Sure. Well, we have to be back in by 10. Says who? My parents. Yeah, right. I'm serious. I'm Charles. Nice to meet you, serious. Yeah, yeah, that's very funny. That's so funny I forgot to laugh. Where could we go? Alright. Well, we could go over to Elizabeth's party. I mean, we could go and like crash it and stuff. Uh-huh, I know why you really want to go over there. Got anything better to do? What about you? Well, that doesn't sound very fun. You got any better ideas, Doug? No. Exactly what I would call crashing the party. Yes? Can uh, I help you? Uh, yeah, we're here for Elizabeth's party. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I wasn't aware any boys were coming over. Uh, Are you sure she's expecting you? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty uh -huh. sure. She invited us, yeah, pretty sure. And your names? Uh, I'm Jesse. He's Charles. And that's Doug. All right. You boys wait out here. I'll go check. Man, he does not want to let us in. Maybe we should go. No way. Elizabeth won't let her boyfriend be driven away. Ain't that right, Jesse? What are you talking about, man? 
Come on in. They're all downstairs. In you go. Hey, Charles. Uh, hey. So, have you seen the new Palo Peralta board yet? Oh, yeah, I, uh, I saw an ad for it in Thrasher. It's pretty cool. Yeah, my brother got one the other day. Really? Cool. Well, aren't you gonna even ask him to dance? <laughs> Good luck. I don't think he'd show up. Yeah, well, here I am. Will you dance with me? Uh, I don't know how. Oh, it's really easy. All you have to do is put your hands on my waist and now just listen to music. And Papa Smurf. La 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 Drunk and poor, how much longer, how much more? I'll rock me to sleep, strong and deep. Screaming cats, they give me the creeps. But aside from all that, I feel no pain. Staring up at the ceiling stain. Guys, wait up. Can I see that lighter? <laughs> Here, man. Oh. Yeah, I feel real relaxed. Here, here, Doc. Oh, no thanks. This thing stunts your growth. So? Oh, come on, man. Maybe if you start smoking it, you won't get as old as fast. Somehow I don't think so. Whatever. Yeah. Take the cigarette. You know, my neighbors could be spying on me, and if they see me smoking, they'll tell my parents. I don't see your neighbors anywhere. I they know. could be. Yeah, I see them over there, Doug. They're right there. Get that you know, oh. One time they even narked on me for burning trash in the backyard. <laughs> I'm oh serious. Guys, Man, I'm serious. Boys. I'm serious. Dude, just try it. No, it's not bad no, at no. all. 
corn. Plus, one time this dog got into their fancy garden in their backyard. And when he caught it, he beat it so hard, I could hear it yelping from all the way inside the house. Do you seriously expect me to believe this oh. crap? Come on, Let's just get going. Let man, you're such a wuss. Why do you always back out on things? Come no. On, no. Let's try it. No, whatever. Let's, let's, let's just go. keep going. Man, why the hell are they still awake? Shouldn't they be sleeping at this hour? Sometimes I stay up to watch Johnny Carson. Oh, great. <laughs> no, that's not it. They're up there because we're here. Douglas? Yeah, Mom? Your father and I are going to bed now, so you boys be sure to keep it down in there. Okay. And don't stay up too late. We won't. Good night, boys. I'll see you in the morning. Okay. okay. Good night, Mrs. McGillis. So what do you think? Give him 15 minutes? Yeah, that'll do it. No way. Half an hour. Half an hour? That's crazy. 15 minutes. Give him at least 25. It'll be exactly midnight then. You know, there's a study shown that the average person falls asleep seven minutes after going to bed. No, uh you're joking. No, no, it's I'm serious. It, it was on like 2020 or something. See? So if we leave in 15, we'll have waited twice the amount we should have. Fine. Well, I don't know why we even had a sleepover at my house if you guys don't like being here. Oh, don't give us that. You know you have the coolest house of all three of us. Yeah. I mean, would you rather have the sleepover at my place instead? Alright, then settle. We leave in 15. eggs in your fridge. Yeah. Can we use some? Yeah. Why not? Because my dad has eggs every Saturday morning for breakfast, and if there are any missing, he'll get suspicious. Dad's ridiculous. Come on. How many does he eat? Four eggs, sunny side up. All right. Now how about we just leave four behind? No. Fine. We'll just find them somewhere else. Okay. Let's go. guys doing here? Here, bust you out, man. Yeah. Well, come on out. Get dressed. I don't know. If my parents catch me, they'll crucify me. So, don't get caught. Yeah, come on, live a little. Yeah, man. I don't know. Come on. Okay, hold on a second. Wait, Martin, do you have any eggs? Uh, yeah, I think so. Can you snag a few? Yeah, sure. Alright. Meet us at trail side, okay? Yeah. See you. See ya. Maybe he got busted. Yeah, maybe. How much longer are we gonna have to wait? Oh, is he? As long as it takes. You never leave a man behind.
Let's give him two more minutes. Eggs, toilet paper, and a couple of other stuff. Dude, you rock. Dude, I didn't even think of bringing toilet paper. Nice, man, yeah. Uh, that car is driving awfully slow. Yeah, sure is. Maybe it's Doug's neighbors out to look for him. <laughs> Quick, Doug, hide in the bushes. Nah, it's neighborhood watch. Ah, uh, neighbors who care. Hey, check this out. should be doing this. Why not? Yeah, dude, you said for yourself that they were a couple of assholes. I know, but they live right next to me. Got a point. We'll throw a couple at your house, too, so that nobody will suspect it was us. <laughs> no way. <laughs> hey, man, this guy's a narc who beats puppies. He's the enemy. Just picture that poor dog being tortured in his backyard. Then tell me if we should be doing this or not. Now, is everyone else ready? I'm ready. Yeah. Doug? Uh-huh. Let's get him. I'm all wound up. Ready to go. I wound up. Ready to go. Bring my buzzer. Bring my bell. Watch me go. Like a bat on a On the train, me and you listening to the rain. Me and you, we are the same. Me and you have all the fame we need. Indeed, you and me are we. Me and you singing in the park. Me and you, we're waiting for the dark. Me and you, we are the spark. Me and you, lighting candles in the dark to say someday. That's because me and you have heard you can fly as high as the sky if you try.
somebody is getting it on in the back of that car. Mm. I don't see anyone. No, see, I saw someone's head going up and down. Oh, I think you're imagining things, Charles. That looks like my sister's boyfriend's car. Actually, that is his car. Dude, I think your sister's getting dorked in there. That can't be. She's way too Catholic. Uh, we should check it out. <laughs> no way. That's my sister in there. You're right. You stay. Oh, go! I know Lucy's boyfriend isn't a Catholic because that's not Lucy he's in there getting busy with. What? <laughs> you gotta check it out. What? Football, a linebacker to be specific. I do believe he even goes to your school, Edison, right? Yeah. What do you know? Small world. You little asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Jason, forget about it. Leave me alone. Kill me. Shut up, bitch. <sighs> Could you please not tell Lucy about this? I really like her, and I don't want her to get upset. What? Five dollars. Five dollars? Don't give him any money. Well, the prom is coming up pretty soon, isn't it, Martin? Uh-huh. Has Lucy brought her dress yet? Uh-huh. Now that's a real shame. Breaking her heart like that. But then again, it doesn't have to be like that. I have the ten. What? Hey, we're over at Martin's all the time. I can't promise one of these guys won't say anything. Yeah. You can't keep my class Ten dollars. Take your leave. All right, all right. Hope you're happy. Very much, thank you. Pleasure doing business with you. And your secret's safe with us. Yeah. Your brother? Yeah, you know, Dexter. He does play football. In Pee Wee League.
what you want to do is keep your hands on it like this, but not too hard. Uh-uh, this is too creepy. Oh, come on, don't be chicken. No way, I've heard too many stories about those things. Like what? Like all kinds of bad stuff happening to people after they've used them. Well, that's just a superstition. It's only a game. I don't care. I'm not going to touch that thing. Suit yourself. Okay, what should we ask it first? I don't know. How about we ask it if Michael's going to ask Melissa out? Forget it. I don't like Michael anymore. Now let's ask it a serious question. Well, like what? Well, if we're supposed to be talking to a spirit, I want to know if it's a good one or a bad one. Don't ask it that. Yeah, go ahead. Ask it. All right. Spirit of the great Ouija board, the mystifying oracle, I ask you, are you a good spirit or an evil spirit? and think about the question. There it goes. You're pushing it. No, I'm not. Well, somebody is. Rachel, are you pushing it? No, if I was, I'd be making it go a whole lot faster. Elizabeth, I'm not pushing it. I think it's going towards E. What is going on down here? And what's with the candles? Rachel? Rachel? Rachel, honey, are you okay? Yeah, just, just a little women's issue, that's all. Oh, um, what, uh, do you need a, a, um... I think so, yes. <sighs> okay, um... Rachel? Oh, thank you. Uh -huh. You're welcome. Uh, listen, um, I think it'd be better if, you, if your mother explained this to you in the morning. Um, and in the meantime, I want it quiet down here, all right? All right? Okay. And don't worry, Rachel's going to be fine. You know what happened, don't you? Rachel got the curse. Uh-huh. You see, I told you that thing was bad luck. It's not that kind of curse. You remember that movie we saw with the two girls talking about the swimming pool? Yeah. That curse. Oh my god. You mean...
pack of cigarettes? Um, Lucky's. Yeah, that, uh, that's what he wanted. <laughs> you gotta be 16 to buy cigarettes. Oh, oh well, they're not for me. They're for my dad. <laughs> He's gonna have to come in and get them himself. Can't he just, like, write me a note or something? <laughs> that's not good enough. If he wants cigarettes, he's gonna have to come get them himself. You know what will happen if I come home empty-handed? He'll beat my ass, dude. <laughs> he, he does have a problem, then. I can't give him to you to give to him. I am 16. You gotta be kidding me. No, I have that same disease that Webster has. No idea, no idea. All right, here's the rules. C come on, just be cool. Show me the cigarettes. <laughs> I don't get paid to be cool. Then just give me the cigarettes. I can get in a lot of trouble selling them to you. Even if they are for your dad. Man, I want some cigarettes, you <laughs> Get a real job, asshole. shouldn't be going over there. Nah, it's cool. Come on, let's go. So what's the difference? It's wet and it's beer. Ugh, that is awful. I don't believe how anybody can drink this crap. My dad doesn't seem to have a problem oh, with it. Yeah, now that's yeah. how it's done. That's good. Guys, I think I gotta go to the bathroom. Yeah, thanks for the announcement. Uh, no, I really gotta go. So, go ahead. Yeah, deep, I mean, there's woods, man. The other one. Really? Because <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh. I'm tight, man. Well, we can go to Elizabeth's. Uh huh. Yeah, I know why you really want to go to Elizabeth's house. Shut up, man. Like that. She's the closest one around here that we know. She has a nice bathroom and stuff. Yeah, right. <laughs> Dude, seriously. I mean, looking how late it is, they're probably asleep by now. Mm-hmm. It's true. Yeah. Okay. Can we talk about something else right now? Ew. Ew. You know, I can't wait until this happens to all of you. Ew, Ew that's so gross. Yeah, that's, that's, that's nasty. That's nasty. That's disgusting. That's, that's so gross. Yeah, kind of like, it'll be good. She like started and she didn't know what it was. 
but um, she started right in front of everybody and she got really embarrassed so she had to walk out of class and the teacher didn't know what was going on so she kind of got yelled at but then she told me. Martin here has to use the bathroom. Yeah. Sorry, you can't come in. If my dad catches you here, I'll be in so trouble. Can't we just come in for a little bit? No. Come on, look at him. It's an emergency. Yeah, an emergency. Please, I really gotta go. So you're a boy, go in the bushes or something. It's not gonna be that easy. Yeah, you might want to let him in, because I really don't think you want him taking a dump on your lawn. Ugh. Fine, but only for a minute. Thank you. And be quiet. So, what you guys been up to? Oh, not the regular. Shut up! What? Well, it's true, isn't it? I have to know. Man, we should have snuck out like you guys. Give me a hand! in here? No one, Dad, no one. It's just your imagination. My imagination? I don't think so. I definitely heard someone down here now. I want the truth. Is that right? Just you? You're backing them up on that? Was it my fault? I didn't touch anything. Yeah, I know. Damn it! We gotta do something about this, man. Like what? I don't know. Give me a minute to think. He's uh, probably getting the third degree in there. Think I'll talk? What's his name? Martin what? I don't remember his last name. It's real long. But he does go to your school, right? Right. So he must speak English then. Dad, can't we just forget about this? Elizabeth! Elizabeth, I want you to go downstairs and let me handle this up here. If your mother wakes up and sees this boy in here, she's going to be devastated. Now move. All right. I know you understand me. So I'm gonna make this real simple, okay? You can either tell me your parents' phone number or I'm calling the police. It's your choice. Come on. Okay, fine. You've made your choice. The police it is, then. Who the hell can that be? You wait right here. I see you. I'm calling the police.
doing here anyway? Going in. What? Are you crazy? It's breaking and entering. No, I have a plan. Alright, yeah. I'm gonna need a boost too, okay? Well, I have to. Because you're the sturdiest. What do you mean, sturdiest? You mean fat, don't you? Of course I don't. Besides, my pants will get all dirty. Stop being such a Kaloid and give me a stupid boost. Don't step on my windpipe. Ugh. Yeah, whatever. You boys stay right there. Hey! think Doug got caught? He'd have to be running to get caught. And I don't even think he did that. Dude, we gotta go back. What? You heard me. We gotta go back. Like you say, never leave a man behind. Yeah, but there's no sense in all of us getting busted. Fine, I'll just go by myself. Are you nuts? Listen, dude, if Doug's parents find out about this, He'll be grinding until he's like 18. If I take the blame for it and my parents find out about it, it'll be no big deal. I'll just get a simple beating. And my dad will probably forget about it within 24 hours anyways. So I'll just go. Please don't tell my parents. Come on, kid. You gotta hold yourself. So what are you boys doing here anyway? I told him to come here. It's all my fault. Oh, yeah? And what exactly do you have in mind? It looks like to me you're trying to break into the building. No, we're just getting my social studies book. There's a test next Monday. You know, <laughs> I could see you boys coming from a mile away. You're not very good at that covert thing, are you? You're just lucky that I stopped you before you got any further. Then I would have no choice but to get the cops involved. Okay, uh, who am I driving home first? Look, I'm not going to sit here all morning. It's either home or the police station, so what's it going to be? Hmm. What's your address, son? 9323 Frontier Drive. All right. Put on a skillet! Get inside before your parents wake up. Hey! And do me a favor, will you? Next time you boys sneak out, be sure to keep up the school properly. Okay? All right. Good luck! are up rather early this morning. Oh, yeah. Uh, we were tired last night because of, you know, school and everything. Did you happen to watch any of the movies I picked up for you? Yep. We watched all of them. Oh, good. I was hoping you might like those. I asked Douglas what to get for you all, and he couldn't think of any suggestion. That's weird. I thought you knew what kind of movies we liked, Doug. I do, but I didn't know which ones you had already seen. Uh, 
Honey, weren't the boys so quiet and well behaved last night? Uh-huh. For a moment, I almost forgot they were even down there. It appears that Mr. Peterson's house was vandalized with eggs and toilet paper sometime during the night. Mr. Peterson asked me if I had seen anything suspicious. You boys wouldn't happen to know anything about that now, would you? Mm -mm, no, we... Douglas? Honey, before you go pointing fingers, I think you should know that the carton I picked up yesterday was still full this morning. And as far as missing any toilet paper, well, you, didn't you know see who that. I bet it was? I bet it was that Sapunsky kid. I'm telling you, that boy's going to end up in jail someday. Just the other day, I saw him rolling tires into the street as cars were driving by. That's awful. <laughs> I really don't think that's very funny. He could have killed somebody with a stunt like that. I just hope you boys know that behavior like that will only lead to bigger problems down the road. Anyway, seeing how you boys are already up and at them, how about helping me with some yard work after breakfast? Honey, are you sure you want to do that? It looks like it's going to rain. Oh, it's just a morning shower and the sun is peeking out through the clouds. I've got to do something about that ivy out back before it swallows up the whole house. What are your plans for the rest of the morning? Well, I thought we would go downstairs and watch some cartoons. Yeah, that's fine with me. Yeah. It sounds like you had a good time last night. <laughs> oh, yeah. We did. Yeah. That's good. Butch Cavendish is out there someplace, Tonto. We're finally coming closer. Yes, Kimasabi. There is much badness in the world. We'll get moving soon. And there is goodness, too. Music is good. And a man must rest sometimes and gather his strength again. Yes, Tonto. I understand.